Okay, so the company Pataka is known for their airmit fiber accessories for iPads, for iPhones, you name it, they got it, right? So this is an accessory that not only works with the iPad to protect it, but it also provides wireless charging. This, my friends, is the MagEase Case Pro for the iPad Pro 12.9. <laughs> so let's talk about it. Okay, so you may say I got a lot of stuff sitting out on this table right here. This is the iPad over here, of course, first and foremost. And then right here we have the MagEase Case Pro for the 12.9. Then over here we have the Pataka Pad Folio. Now this works with any of your Magic Keyboard. And this device right here will work with all this stuff simultaneously. So let's go ahead and just talk about it. Now this, my friends, is a aramid fiber covering, it's basically a bumper that is going to protect your device. Aramid fiber on the back, it's a hard shell on the inside. It also sports a magnet on the inside as well. And then you have your magnetic clasps on the back and it also connects to the Magic Keyboard via the pin connectors on the back as well. And it has a built-in USB Type-C. One of the things I really appreciated about the built-in USB Type-C on this model is that it actually moves. So now I will show you, and I got one around here somewhere, the casing for the iPad mini. So this was the casing for the iPad mini. Actually, it shows the magnetic clasp back here that you can connect wirelessly. But if you take a quick look at the USB type C port on the inside, it is actually built into this case, one whole piecing. So if you snatch the iPad out the wrong way, you're going to bend that USB type C uh, plug. So that's one thing I did not like about this version of it. So, so fast forward a couple of years and Pataka has learned that, you know, you may not want to put that as one piece in there. So I'll show you how we're going to connect it when I actually put mine in. But um, that's pretty much all that it is to show you as far as how this is going to work. And the other piece that makes this whole thing tick is the USB type C wireless charge. So whether you are wirelessly charging a phone or anything, it's still going to have a cable that's going to be connected to it. Um, so this is a wireless charge for your iPad Pro. Now, with that being said, let's go ahead and slap the iPad in. Let's see how it charges. And it's gonna charge specific to whatever wattage charger you have. So if you got a 15 watt, you got a 10 watt, you got a 20 watt charger, it's gonna charge through that wireless connection as fast as whatever wattage your adapter will support. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and pop this bad boy in and let's see what looks like, feels like, and charges light. So you notice when I get all this in, then I find that USB type C slot, pop that bad boy in and we are good. Next thing is I want to make sure that we do have some sound going so you can actually hear um, this charging up. And we do have very tactile buttons on here. So no issue with the buttons up top as well as on the sides. Buttons feel good. They're very tactile, very responsive. Now, there we go. Like it was an immediate, and it's it's a, it's not gonna hold the iPad cause it's kind of heavy, but as soon as you lay it down on there, you got a charge. You can hear it, just one more time. And the magnetic connection is really stable, really strong. With this whole Maggie's case, you're gonna be able to use this with the iPad's Magic Keyboard. So whole thing just goes in just like that. Uh, Padfolio is probably one of my favorites just because it closes together just like a briefcase. You can hold it just like so, carry this, and gives you a little extra flair uh, when you are using your iPad. People kind of stop by and wanna know what that is on your device. And the Padfolio actually has a camera protector on the back back here. So this piece can be down on the camera or it can be folded back just like so. 
out of the way. So if you can take pictures, if you like to take pictures with your iPad, go for it. You know, I'm not one of those picture iPad people, but um, I see nothing wrong with this whole setup. It's gonna give you an extra layer of protection for the iPad and everybody wants that protection and it gives you another layer of functionality because you can now take this directly off and just use it like this. And if you do drop it on a table or something, you got the air fiber backing. Now, once again, this is gonna cover all the way around except for this portion that's out right here. Uh, your Apple Pencil will charge through here. I don't have my official Apple Pencil in here. This is from the company Binks, but it will magnetically stick. And if you can see that light right there, that light lets you know that it is charging. So it, this charges through the actual tablet. So this pencil, wireless charging, you put it on here, it will start to charge. That just lets you know that the Apple Pencil will charge as well. So uh, my Apple Pencil is probably in my car right now in another bag with another iPad. So, but trust me, it will work. Don't worry about it. If you buy it and it doesn't work, you can, you can blame me for it. But for the most part, this is a great device. Now, Pataka also has, and if I can find it, here we go. They have another case called the MagEase Folio. Now, I've done a full review on this. If it's not um, out yet, it will be out very shortly. But the these will work together in conjunction, just like so. And now when this is in this shell and it's in this casing, it gives you total protection for your iPad. You really don't have to worry about much when you got this in there. And then when you get tired of using it just like this and all your features and functions are still gonna work, your auto sleep wake, your standing capabilities, let's just get that boom. Just like so, all your standing capabilities, everything is gonna work. You don't have to worry about that. And when you get done with it, you just open it up. Now I wished, what I do wish that it was some type of flap that you could easily get to it. But when you get done with it, you just pop it out and you are good to go. So we got a lot of stuff we talked about from the bumper style casing to the pad folio to the actual Maggie's case uh, two for the iPad itself. Now we do have a stand. Now this stand I've had for a while and it's probably been one of my favorites and I'm kind of going to bring it back now because it actually has the capability that I need. Like at first I was only using it with my iPad mini. But now that I can use this with my 12.9, I can charge my phone on it, I can charge my uh, AirPods on it. It is endless to the possibilities of what we can do. So this is the Mag E stand. I, basically it plugs in via USB type C and once you plug it in, you can just sit your iPad on there. It will tilt, it will move, and it will charge your iPad for you. So. Nothing better than coming home, taking your iPad off your Magic Keyboard, sitting it up here, accessing Stage Manager, using it on your monitor. You got plenty of different options that you can use with these different Pataka devices. And one of the best things is they actually work with PetaFlow. So PetaFlow is what is gonna allow all your Pataka devices to work together in unison. So go by and check all this stuff out. I'm gonna drop links below so you can do that. Hopefully this has been able to help someone out. We're looking forward to a new iPad coming out very shortly, a real new iPad, not just a chip or processor upgrade. So stay tuned for those kind of videos. We got a lot of them coming. But until next time, Average Tech out, peace.